turn that on. All right. Okay, why is he doing that again? There we go. That's what I want. <clears throat> All right. So, hello everyone. Welcome back to the Pokemon Sword Nuzlocke. Um, I got everyone to level 60 except for Liberty. I eventually got to a point where I was like, you know what? I just want to finish this. 55 should be okay. So, Liberty's got Rock Slide, Safeguard, Extra Sensory, Heavy Slam. And we got Paramour, the Toxicity, with Boom Burst, Toxic, Overdrive, Poison, Jab. Charmin, the Beware, with Double Edge, Brutal Swing, Hammer Arm, Super Power, which I learned during training. Then we have Speedy, the Gastrodon, Agent Power, Rain Dance, Money, Water, and Earth Power. Then we have Claire, the Corviknight, with Brave Bird, Steel Wing, Drill Peck, and Hone Claws. Sonya, the... Scrafty with Brick Break, Crunch, Rock Slide, and Protect. So, let's see. Given. We're gonna have to face Beatty, Beatty, or whatever. Sonya's probably better. I don't know why I'm saving, but whatever. We'll save. All right, let's go report in to Wyndham Stadium. I think I have to go this way. Should have upgraded my bike. Just to make this faster, or, late, or maybe I should just start out in front of here. Holy crap. Hey, Fizzy Pop, how's it going? Oh wait, no, I don't face Beta yet. I face, uh... Pretty sure I face Hop, don't I? Oh, I thought this told you. Well, I have Sonya up front anyways, right? Yeah, I do. Sonya will be fine. I believe I face Hop first, then Marnie? Or Marnie, however the hell you pronounce her name. Marnie? <laughs> I guess it's been so long since... Yeah. I was thinking I was facing Bayday first. Oh, okay, so it's Marnie. All right, and then it'll be Hop. Well, either way, it's a good thing that I have Sony up front. I did almost lose Paramore during uh, training, though. I went up against a Gengar, and it crit Shadow Balled me, and I just about lost it or her. She was at 12 HP. I was like, oh, hell no! <laughs> So I swapped to Sonya to, no not Sonya, I swapped to Charmin and then Brutal swung that Gengar.
And at that point, I was like, I'm just going to go to lower level crap and just, uh, just stick there. <laughs> I was trying to get Liberty to level 60 and then get some other Pokemon trained to like level 55 as replacements in case I lose them. But I just woke up this morning like, I'm done. <laughs> Alright. Now it's great that I have Moxie. Wait, I don't want to swap. Okay. Now if she would have thrown out Toxicrope, I... Crope. Crope! I probably would have swapped. Oh, I forgot to silence my phone. There we go. Anyways, if she threw out Toxicrope, then I would just be like, uh, no, I'm done. Because I don't have anything super effective against them. Like, I went to all the Watt vendors, and I couldn't find, like, Zen Headbutt or anything that I could use. Although, given the level difference and the fact that I have plus two right now, I should be okay. Yeah, we'll keep the current Pokemon. We'll see how this goes. I mean, I don't think he... Well, he would have a Fight-type move to use against me, but... I'm 13 levels up. I should be able to live at least one thing that he has, no matter what it is. I could Dynamax just to be safe. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. We're not doing this bullshit. I'm not dealing with that confusion bullshit. Not in a Nuzlocke. How many Pokemon do you have left? Three? You know what? I'm going to Dynamax right now. Should be more than enough to take you out. And I'll get in there a Moxie boost. Sonia, show them what you got. True, I didn't even think about the swagger boost. For some reason, I was thinking that um, I cured the confusion, <laughs> so swagger was gone. <laughs> Normally, I just swap out because I'd rather not confuse myself. Grim Snarl might be a problem, but with the boost, I should be all right. Damn, you're that much quicker. Well, at least you didn't paralyze me. All right, since I'm Dynamax and level difference, I should be able to live one of any type of move for Grim Snarl wants to go for. It. Max it. Oh. Gigantamax. Almost looks like Grimmsnarl goes Super Saiyan whenever Gigantamax is. Okay, I was faster. Sweet. Down you go. Alright, that's one down. Oh, you're gonna cheer me on, don't lie. All 
Alright, if I remember correctly, they fully restore my Pokemon. I just want to double check that before I go back out there, because I am going to leave with Sonya again. Okay, yeah. Alright. Maybe I can sweep with Sonya again. I got really lucky when I caught this Scraggy, and it had Moxie. I, I mean, I couldn't be luckier. I think the other one it could have is what? Shed Skin? Which, that would have been really nice for the confusion. Got a swagger boost and then just shed that off. <laughs> yep. Except for the uh, two times that it, he changes his team. Because then one time it was his Corviknight and then the other one was a Trevenant. Yeah, that's right. Smack them cheeks because I'm about to clap them. I expect that to be a two shot because of the uh, fluffy ability. Hi, right, I'll take it. <laughs> you see, that's another thing I don't get. He knows that I just used the super effective move against his double, and he throws out Snorlax. I think he always throws out Snorlax second. Like, oh yeah, this is the one that will stand up to that fighting type. Like, Hop honestly has to be the worst rival. Alright, Corviknight. Do I want to risk it? I'll switch, just in case. I'm pretty sure that I'll be fine with Sonya, but... Yep, that too. Well, you see, if this was the anime, it would work, at least as far as Ash's Pikachu is concerned. Because, you know, Ash's Pikachu is so overpowered that it can make ground-type uh, Pokemon hurt by its electric moves. Yeah, exactly. Pen urchin, that's pure electric. I I don't have any Pokemon with ground type. Oh no, I do have a what am I uh speedy It's still throwing me off that I have a Pokemon with a ground type move because the first time I played this I didn't have any Pokemon that learned ground type moves. But now with the Nuzlocke I do. Switch a Pokemon, I got the perfect one. Alright, you're gonna Dynamax, so I'm gonna Dynamax. Um, which one does more base power? 130? Oh, they both do 130. Um... We'll go with Max Geyser. Time for Dynamax! You almost fell over, you dork!
Let me guess, you're gonna pyro ball. Oh no. Even though I'm a faster Pokemon, I gotta raise my speed. Bye bye. Yeah, I definitely made my team too overpowered for this, but it's a Nuzlocke, so screw it. And I lost two Pokemon during training. Yeah, they are pretty easy. Um, honestly, the Pokemon... I, I'll i go over how I lost each Pokemon, but... Um, hurry up. The only bad thing is, is that it doesn't give you a whole lot of opportunities for captures. Like, other... Like, I did a Pokemon Fire Red, which I put on my YouTube channel. I think I had at least two full boxes of captures. <clears throat> But this one, I didn't even fill a box. And even if I didn't lose Pokemon in my uh, uh, attempts to capture them or lose the encounters, I probably still wouldn't have filled the box. Well, that's why uh, I would always position myself a little bit farther away and I would close my eyes and I would run into the grass. Actually, speaking of that, I still don't have an encounter at the Lake of Outrage, but I don't know. At this point, I don't think there's really any Pokemon that I could use. I mean, a Dragon-type would be nice if I could possibly get it, but that also depends on the weather. Let's be nice. Let's get this crap over with. So, how I lost... Oops. Alright, so I only lost four Pokemon. Alright, so Victor... Okay, I lost five. Victor, I lost because I went up against that reporter and the cameraman. And the Thievil kept using Snarl. And Victor's special defense is crap. And I didn't feel comfortable switching anybody else in, so... I was trying to heal him, but it got to a point to where it was like, well, Victor, might as well just go down. So, he died in a trainer battle. Oberon died due to some of the most unluckiest bullshit I have ever seen. Thrown out against a cool fish, I was like eight levels above it. And I'm like, you know, I should be okay. Oberon is eight levels above. One attack, it'll be over. So, I hit him. 
Quinfish hits me with a poison type move. I think it was poison jab. It critted, poisoned me, and I was in the hail. So after the crit, after the poison, I think I had like 12 health or something. I'm like, please, God, hail, do not take me out. The hail takes me out. So Oberon died to like the most unluckiest circumstances. Rhonda died during uh, uh, the gym battle with Raihan. And that that was just because he decided to uh, use Max Steel Spike on her. Zarian, I lost because I forgot Freeze Dry is super effective. and threw it up against Mr. Uh, Mime to train. And Freeze Drive, crit, bam, gone. Gunther, I lost during training. I had it up against... What was it? How did I lose Gunther? I forgot how I lost Gunther. But Gunther wound up getting like one shot. Which is surprising because Gunther was a freaking wall. Yeah, there are some heavy losses. Oh, and then the uh, other Pokemon that I was training up. I have Kuja at level 52, I have Charlotte at 50, Merica at 47, Letra at 46, and Churchill at 42. These were my uh, possible replacements. But as you can see, I really don't have much. Because even with um, um, the Pokemon that I have in the death box, I wouldn't even fill this box. So Pokemon Sword and Shield is a bad place to, or a bad game to do a Nuzlocke. Because you don't have much for encounters. And I only ever ran into one fire type, and I lost that encounter. And that was in, uh, Kabu's gym. Man, Olena has got to be a big simp for Chairman Rose. This is ridiculous. Yeah, he's got the same sunglasses on that I do. Like, honestly, the first time I played through this, I never paid attention to, like, the official people. So I didn't even realize that the sunglasses was a difference. So I went around just asking every single one of them, Hey, are you the guy? <laughs> Like, in terms of, like, villains, this game has crap villains, too. Actually, I don't even think there's really any villains in this game. Just a guy with a misguided vision. He didn't go for world domination or anything. He had the best intentions at heart, but he was going about it all wrong. No matter what Pokemon I use, it's going to resist. Because I don't have a Fire-type or a Fire-type move. Exactly! No, you're not going to learn Rain Dance. Hey, 
And then not only that, you also have um, the whole Brexit thing, or Dexit thing uh, going on for it too. Where they cut out the Pokemon just so that way they can um, charge us later for them. Like, I didn't buy this game for a long time because of that, but then um, I was streaming uh, Pokemon, uh, not Pokemon, uh, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, and Nome, uh, or Nomi, um, went and raided me with her uh, people, and then I followed her, and I was like, hey, you know, I'll check her out, you know, maybe she might have some videos I want to watch, and so I started watching, she was playing it, she seemed like she was having a lot of fun, my wife wanted to play it, so I was like, screw it, let's just get it. Otherwise, I fully intended on boycotting this. You might search my Pokemon while it's running. Well, maybe you should have, oh, I don't know, more Pokemon? Instead of just two? Who the hell remembers phone booths? <laughs> you know, growing up as a kid where I live, I don't think I've ever seen a phone booth at all. I really, I really need a fire type. You know what? After I fight this guy, I might just look at the weather at Lake of Outrage. And if it's sunny or something, then I'm going to see if I can't possibly run into a fire type. And it should start at level 60, so I won't have to train it. Break, break. Hello, Cody. Welcome back to the stream. Been a while. Moon Pie G Fuel tastes like coffee creamer. One out of ten. Do not recommend. <laughs> so what you're saying is I need to put in my coffee. <laughs> Battle them all! However, starfruit tastes like happiness and orgasms 11 out of 10 or again. Oh, shit. How the hell did you put that into a song? <laughs>
And yeah, I'm here a little sleepy, but I'm here. I am also present. Yeah. Cody, uh, say hi to Fizzy Pop. Fizzy Pop, say hi to Cody. <laughs> Let's look at the weather for the Lake of Outrage. Wait, I went up. Thundering! So I can get electric type or I could possibly get a dragon. Who be Pop of the Fizz, Stranger Danger? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Alright, so actually, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna fly back. I'm gonna fly to Hammerlock. So that way I can uh, heal my Pokemon quick. And then I'm going to try and catch a dragon. Um, given that it's lightning, in case I run into electric, Speedy would be the best one to put out there. And this would be my last encounter for this entire Nuzlocke. Dangerous, yes, yeah. <laughs> First Pokemon you see ends up being a Caterpie. Well, you see, I'm not going to see it because if you remember, Cody, I always line myself up with a patch of grass and then I close my eyes and I run in. So I'm not going to see it coming. And no, there's no way a Caterpie is going to be there. All right, last encounter of the Nuzlocke. Let's see what we could do. Insert hacks now. Yeah, fuck you, Cody. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna grab this here quick, just for the hell of it. All right. Okay, I don't see any Pokemon in the grass, so here we go. One, two, three, close my eyes and go! what I get? Oh, shit! Yeah! I'll take it. I didn't hack! Y'all are crazy. That did more damage than I would have liked. Oh, I couldn't get any boosts. Okay. Um, as long as he does a crit, Speedy can live one more hurricane. And he should be... Okay. So, I think what I'm going to do next is that after I hit him with the Sage Power, I'm going to switch to Corviknight quick. So that way he can resist pretty much anything Noivern has to throw. Because with that Screech, I do not feel confident in case it breaks out of the ball. There are hacks present. There's no hacks present. Oh, and it's got Tailwind too. Nice. Alright, now hopefully this is a good nature Pokemon. Um. You know what? Let's try level ball. I know it's only two levels, but yeah, I didn't think it would work, but screw it. Uh, I don't think Pokemon run away in this game. Alright, Ultra Ball. Oh no, this won't be the last encounter, because they still have, uh, Eterni Eternitas and, um, Sacian. 
This will be the last, like, in the wild encounter. Let's put it that way. Alright. So, I already have a name for this Pokemon. And it's a World of Warcraft reference. Onyxia. And it's great because... Female, baby. Otherwise, if it was male, probably would have been, um... Probably would have been Nefarian. I think I spelled that right. Should have looked it up. It might be I-X-Y-A, but whatever. Um, let's look at the summary here. Tack downs. Ooh, this is a good one. Screech, Roost, Tailwind, Hurricane. Um, okay, you're going in the party. It just sucks that you're a glass cannon, but I really don't need Liberty. Yeah, we'll place that in the bag. All right, and then I still have those wise glasses. Ooh, I almost got a... Oh, shit! This one's like, hey, I want to fight! I should have just flew out. Maybe I could just run? There we go. All right, so let's fly out of here. Um, actually, before that, I want to see if this Watt Trader has anything good that I can use for Norburn. Um, let's get Wise Glasses on it, so that way it can level, or not level up, but, uh, increase special moves. Okay, Uproar, Seed Bomb, Grass Knot, Flamethrower, Iron Tail. Now you see, I... I don't know if Onyxia can learn those two. I'm gonna buy them anyways. If they can't, well, that sucks. Maybe there's someone in my team that could learn Flamethrower. Uproar would be a good one since it does have sound, uh, sound boost, uh, boom burst. All right, let's see what I got for Onyxia here. Payback, Swift is a physical move. We want special. Snore, U-turn, hacks, rest. Alright, Hurricane has a pretty good chance to miss. Um, so we'll give it an air flying type move for coverage. It can if you just believe. Huh. <laughs> well, we'll see. Insurance, breaky swipe, rock slide, flamethrower. Yes, it can learn flamethrower. Thank God. All right, um, given that Neuvern's already a glass cannon. It's also very speedy, so I'll give it flamethrower. And it can learn uproar. Whoops. What should I replace? Probably just Roost. Yeah, we'll replace Roost. I'll just make this a purely attacking one. Alright, so now let's fly back. Yeah. Yeah, I believed it when I saw it. <laughs> All 
Now I have an even more balanced team. Honestly, if I want to be more balanced, I should replace Charmin or Sonya, but... Or Claire. Oh well, I'm happy with this team. By the way, the Star Kiss Tuna creations of Dijon Balsamic Vinegar is nummy, 70 calories, a packet with lots of protein. I can't stand tuna, dude. I can't do it. Alright, let's buy... Oh, I can't buy a lot of those. Um, it's because I bought all those full restores. Ah, damn it. I don't think there's really anything else that I need. Well, I don't need these dire hits and all that. Nope. I can't do tuna salad sandwiches. I can't do anything tuna. I hate it. Alright, since it doesn't have, like, any actual training, let's get some calcium and some carbos for it. Just give a little bit of a boost. Safe. Wait, I can just fly back. What am I doing? So they're all going to have Steel-type Pokemon. Let's get Onixie up front. Get her up front, and then we'll get her some training, since she's got Flamethrower. You know, for someone declaring a... Oh, shoot. <laughs> for an intruder alert, they really don't send a whole lot of guards. I mean, is this place even staffed? I mean, seriously, like, obviously there's staff here, but is it staffed? Oh, no, I'm gonna shake my finger at you. All right, Onyxia. At this stage, you should have, like, four Pokemon minimum.
Or one level 100 magic card. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Oh, come on! Hop, you are so goddamn stupid. Oh, no, 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 no! Don't be doubling into me, you assholes! Alright, well, that extra sentry didn't do that much. In comparison. Yeah, it Q-Fed did get sat on, but uh, Hop should have been smart enough and used Double Kick. Then again, they always made your rivals a bit stupid. Just a bit, but Hop is especially stupid. That's right, be my healing bitch. Do you have a life insurance policy? He literally just asked you you had a life insurance policy. He's basically saying we're gonna kill you. What a dick, and you said that to a child. Well, I'm definitely going into that, uh, Mawile first. Bye-bye. Please paralyze him, come on. Apparently you want to kill a kid, so... You know, that's another thing I never got about these Pokemon games. How is it that a 10-year-old is able to out-battle people who have been doing this for years? <clears throat> yeah, the story is long, though. It's almost as if they tried to craft a, like an actual story, but it just fell flat on its face. Who do I see as a bigger threat? Probably the Steelix. Because I think, I think, uh, because like the Pokemon battles, there isn't really that much. Yeah, I guess children are just better. When you become an adult, you just suck at Pokemon. 
Oh, come on, Stunfisk. Alright, um... Just because I feel like being... Ah, uh, nah, never mind, Onyxia will be fine. It's just Hurricane. Wait, that hit? He's up in the air! That hit? Well, I just learned something new. They bond better with Pokemon is what kids got going for them. But yet you have uh, people who have been with their Pokemon since childhood that are adults and they wind up losing. And it's not like they just discovered Pokemon either because in uh, Pokemon X and Y, they had a... The Pokemon War or whatever, that was like, what, a thousand years prior or something like that? Adults get boring, though. True, adults suck. Being an adult sucks. Adulting sucks. I want to go back to when I was 16. I think that was the perfect age. Where you're young enough to get away with stupid crap, but old enough to where you can have a job and afford your own stuff and kind of be independent on your own without having to worry about your parents. Okay, so my Pokemon are healed. Alright, and I've got Gastrodon for her uh, Garbodor. Oh, there's the anime crazy eyes! See, I think it would have been a better story if it was something like Olena, um, was behind Chairman Rose, you know what I mean? Like, she was pulling the strings. Yes, please step on me. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, damn. My, how cheeky. Do such thing as hurt my partner. Well, if you don't want your partner to be hurt, then don't battle. It's a lazel. Swap, and we'll go back to Anixia. Oh, come on! No, I'm gonna uproar for the hell of it. Yep, we're gonna swap into Paramore. Oh, I just now saw that. It's like using Earthquake on a Pokemon as dig. Okay, well that makes sense.
All right. I should be able to one-shot with Speedy. We see Elena's gonna finish this. Are you having like a split personality moment or did you name your Garbodor Olena and we just don't know it? Okay, I did not think that Garbodor would be faster than me, especially since Speedy has a speed positive nature. Now, if she had, oh no. Venom Shock would change, so I don't have to worry about it being double on the power. It's a talking in a third person moment. Yeah. I can see that. God, Elena, you are so goddamn stupid. Let me show you a real Max Quake. Okay, I seriously thought that was going to be a one shot. Oh, the leftovers. I was like, I didn't heal. Alright, so I should be okay. No matter what move I go for next, I should be able to live her attack. Yeah, especially if it match quicks again. And down you go. Bye bye. Okay, yeah, another third person moment right there. I think this is just dialogue here, right? We don't face Rose here. Another thing I think that could have made this game better is that, if I remember correctly, reading one of Rose's cards, he came in second place the year that uh, Leon became champion. That could have been a whole storyline, too. Like, he's still sour that he lost, so he's doing everything he can to undermine him or something or, you know, build his power up. I don't know. I think they could have done so much better with this story.
Yeah, let's just trust her all of a sudden. Whoops. I, I'm pretty sure they're already healed, but I just want to double check. Okay, yeah. All right, we'll keep old Nixie up front because next we're going to fight Rose, I believe. And then we fight Eternitas. Okay, so we fight the gym leaders now. All right, so first we fight Nessa, and then since this is sword version, we fight Bay. That's right, we fight the we fight Beatty first. Okay, this is when we fight Beatty. Damn it! That's not what I want. Alright, so I believe he leads off with a pure psychic type first. So Sonia would be a good one to put up. Really, I might be able to sweep Beta with Sonia again. The only thing that concerns me is that the Hatterene, if it manages to live an attack four times effective, it could take me out. Let's do it. No, because I think he still has Gothitelle and um, Musharna, if I remember correctly, which are pure psychics. He leads with Galar Ninetales. Uh, there isn't a Galar Ninetales. There's a Galar Galarian um, Rapidash. Um, God, now it's got me scared. All right. Um, we're going to switch to Corviknight instead, or Claire. It's all right. For the longest time, I was forgetting what Flygon's name was. Like, I was like, that ground dragon type, what the hell is his name? <laughs> There's just way too many freaking Pokemon anymore. And it doesn't help that they keep releasing new versions of Pokemon either. Like, even when the Alolan Pokemon came out, I was like, why? What you basically just said is, is that we're too lazy to come up with enough new Pokemon to justify a new game. I was thinking Alola and said Galar. Oh, I didn't even think about that. But isn't that a fairy? Yeah, it's very ice type. So yeah, I could have started with that. Either way, Corviknight's a good a good lead. It just sucks that Steel Wing can miss. My wild. Okay. Alright, so Sonya would have been a good lead against this one. Everyone's dumb every so often. It happens to everyone. Alright, I'm gonna home claws just because I can get accuracy. Alright, 
Alright, how much damage does he do? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna set up on him. Oh shit, I can't with that de well. I am quicker. Alright, let's do Steel Wing. Maybe I can get my defense back. But with two Home Claws. Come on. Damn it, drop my defense again. Alright, so after I knock out this Mawile. Oh, of course you full restore. But after I knock out this Mawile, I'll swap. Because I'm not going to risk it with two defense drops. Gardevoir, my favorite Pokemon. All right, um, shit, 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 shit. Why'd you have to get two defense drops? Gardevoir doesn't really have a high special, or not special, but physical. I'm going to risk Paramore. Poison Jab should one shot. There we go. Rapidash. Same thing. Well, I don't even know if uh, Rapidash is physically bulky at all. Let's poison jab again. Let's go, Paramore! No, I'm gonna let it ride. Well, yeah, I'm gonna win. I'm whooping your ass. Dynamax and Max Ooze. And then I... Hatterin is a slow ass Pokemon. Should I should move first. So even if this doesn't one shot. Max Ooze. Oh no, that old special attack. This is up uh special defense. But I should live. Given the level difference. Hatterin right there above like the neck chest area whatever the hell um to me it reminds me of that flower boss from uh, Final Fantasy 9 are you kidding me I was nine levels, nine levels above, and I get one-shotted, nine! <sighs> Coming out, Speedy.
Should not have risked Paramore. Yeah, it is sad. Now Nessa's just gonna be a bitch, because I don't have... I don't have a grass type. The only electric I have is like on like level 50 or something. Six, not even ready to take him on. Charlotte would be the closest. Well, give me a bug type at least, I guess. All right. Um, all that's left is to turn into Leon, right? I gotta fight uh, Nessa and uh, Bay next. All right. I don't think their Pokemon are any higher to like level 53, so Charlotte could possibly take them on just fine. Wait, I didn't put uh, I didn't put Paramore in the death box, did I? No, I didn't. Gonna save the game again. Uh, no, I don't believe so. Storm Drain. So, oh, okay. So, actually, yeah, that would be a good one to have. I've got a backup. But I'm gonna rock out with Charlotte and see how that goes. You don't want to underestimate me, but yet you don't come with six Pokemon. Okay, so you're going to smack me with a first impression. Just discharge. I should be able to live because I resist it. Holy crap. Okay, so I'll keep current Pokemon and I'll heal. Sea King should not do that much damage. Actually, I think I should be faster. But still, I'm not going to risk that. Let's see how much damage the Sea King does. Shouldn't do shit. Well, I can live one more at least. We'll discharge. Okay, so I was faster. Really? Oh, come on! I'm four times super effective! I don't know, I've never used Galvantula. Is Galvantula just crap for special attack? Of course you full restore. You know, I should have done that. Get a crit, please. Nope.
You know, I didn't even think to check any of my TMs. I might have a grass type one or electric that I can put on someone. Barascuda. Alright, we'll go to speedy. Try and get a boost. Ha! Thank you. Although I don't think I have any special type moves. One more ancient power. Don't freeze me. Pelipper. Keep going. I hate this toilet bird. Come on, give me some boost. Give me a boost. Give me a boost. Come on. Turtle boy. Knock off Blastoise. If I get one shotted, I swear to God. Bye-bye. All right, so next is Bay. Yeah, it is a nice win. All right, Bay, and then we face Raihan. At least that one is one-on-one -on -one battles. God, I wish he still had Oberon, though. That would have been perfect. All right, so for Bay, I'm gonna swap. I'm gonna swap Liberty back in. I don't think she has any part dark types. I'm probably completely wrong on that one.
You can tell she never skips leg day. Holy crap. Well, show me. That was about half. But that was a one shot. Go, Liberty. Sir fetched. If I can live a high jump kick and only lose half, I don't think Surfetched has anything around that power. And I'm faster. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. All right. I'm going to knock you out. Swap or do I heal? I think I'm gonna heal and see what happens. True, I didn't even think that it could have had close combat, but luckily they went for the super effective move instead of the neutral damage. Because I think close combat, even with it being neutral damage, would have done more than brutal swing. Close combat. Okay, I did not like that at all. Oh, that was a crit. All right, I'm gonna full heal or full restore again. So it does under seventy. So I can live one more as long as he don't crit. Hopefully I'm faster. All right, do not crit me. Okay, good. I'm gonna swap out after this. I'm not messing with the grab block. I know those things can be powerful. Um, could go to Onyxia, actually. Let's go to Onyxia. Close combat uh, is a priority move. Uh, I don't think close combat is a priority move. I think you're thinking of uh, Mach Punch. Gap, eh? I just thought of something. He probably has a rock type move. I might lose Onyxia here because I completely forgot my champ gets rock slide. Hopefully this max airstream one shots. I doubt it because it's gonna be get Gigantamax, but hopefully. Come on. Come on, give me a one shot or at least be stupid and don't use a rock slide. Why didn't I think of this beforehand? Corviknight would have been at least been able to have it be normal damage. Thank you for the one shot, Onyxia. Thank you. Alright, 
next is uh, Raihan, and I believe he always starts out with his uh, Gigalith. Really, if I do it right, I can sweep with Sonya. Should be able to sweep with Sonya. Sonia, you're gonna take the lead. Um, Rayhan, I've got the Pokemon for it. I was thinking about switching Liberty out, but I've got the Pokemon for it. All right, Sonia, kind of want to give Sonia a high jump kick, but I want to have the uh, scope lens or whatever it is that increases the accuracy. You know, with that jacket there, it always looks like he has, like, a beer gut whenever he's walking around. rock slide and I miss of course I miss well good thing I didn't lead with uh, speedy He isn't using fire type moves. Oh, come on. Go ahead, use full restore. Because after uh, Sonya goes to sleep, I'm full restoring. Raihan? Yeah, he does look weird. Even without the beer gut. That's right, I'm just waiting for your sunlight to run out. And then what you gonna do then? You're better off using fire type moves. There we go. Thanks for wasting your sunlight. Seriously, thank you. And for some reason, I did more. Oh, it was a crit. That's why. A 
Let's see. Nope, we'll keep current Pokemon. Now, I think he goes for that Shell Trap first. I'm going to protect. Let's see what he goes for. Yep, there's a Shell Trap. I don't think he can use it in succession. Alright, so you're going to use Shell Trap. So I'll protect. And Rock Slide once again. Alright, I'm going to be able to sweep a Sonya. Gudra is Water Dragon. Let's go with a Crunch. We'll save these for his uh, Nine Tails. Because I believe he has Nine Tails, unless I think about somebody else. Flygon. care set up the sand ain't gonna help you I don't have a special scrafty Or he had a, a nine tails. All right, time to Dynamax and then Max Knuckle you. Oh, maybe. Think of it, Leon's team doesn't really make sense. Because, I don't know. For a champion team, it doesn't seem to make sense to me, at least. One hit that he wants to give me, and I should be able to take it out with a max knuckle. Oh, yeah, I can live a narrow one of those. Even with the attack boost, he gets, I believe I can live a narrow one of those. But with my boost, you ain't living, buddy. And that's how you take down a skyscraper.
Oh, I gotta beat him, man. Otherwise, Nuzlocke's over. Oh, it doesn't matter who I lead off with. Well, I'm gonna save the game. It doesn't matter who, because he gets interrupted, and then we gotta fight Chairman Rose. And then we fight Eternitas. We're gonna have a real champion of a time. What's that on the screen? A lunatic. Oh, wait, I gotta go around and, uh, beat all the Dynamax Pokemon first before we go face off against the chairman. Yeah, lunatic with a comb over, exactly. <laughs> He's got his Charizard to guide him, remember? Oh, we gotta go to the slumbering wield, weld, or whatever first. Okay. That way we can get the sword and the shield. Wait, I can get some captures here now. more stuff to sell. You run past this grass and then that's grass because these are all low level. Now, the next area will have higher level Pokemon.
Can we fight Hop again in this area? Alright, hold up. Let's lead off with Corviknight. Alright, let's reset that grass. Three, two, one, let's go! Come on, run into something already! Okay, I already have an orbital. So I'm gonna use the uh, dupes claws and go for a different encounter. Here we go. I already have a wheezing, so dupes claws again. I'm gonna go one more time in this patch of grass, and if I don't run anything, I'm gonna try a different one. Now I saw that Wheezy pop up. Hold up. Um, just a bunch of Wheezings here, isn't it? Okay, here we go. Another Wheezing. What? And all the Wheezings? <laughs> Three, two, one, here we go. Another wheezing. All right, I'm gonna try a different patch of grass. Isn't this way towards an item? I could fish. It is an option. Okay, so Musharnet, you're just going to run to Weezy unless you run into a literal small circle. Yeah, okay, so I see a Musharna there. I'm going to reset. All right, here we go. Alright, Muna. I don't have Muna. Alright, I don't have any Pokemon. Well, no, I have, um... I have Liberty. Answer Sentry should not take it out. Especially since it resists. Oh, there was a wheezing in there? I don't know, I have my ass closed. Extra sensory. Wow, crit capture. All right, so what should I call Muna? I'm gonna call it my pillow. All 
Oh yeah, there is a wheezing. <laughs> it's like, pardon me, do you want a kipper? <laughs> mean to run into any Pokemon, but whatever. Holy crap! There's Corviknights here. On dumb fossil. All right, so can can you want to learn Phantom Force? Because that might be a good one to have. No, nope, nobody that I have can learn Phantom Force. Breaking swipe. No one can learn that either. I don't have any water type TMs or anything that people can learn. Well, except for dive. Eh, stick with muddy water. Oh, there's a uh, stun fist. Wait, we gotta fight Hop, don't we? That's alright, I'll sweep you again. Basically, come and give us their blessing. That's what I think about it. With that whole having to fight all the gyms again, basically. Am I confusing that with the uh, Sword and Shield Brothers? Actually, come to think of it, I think I am confusing it with that. I think we just pick up the Sword and Shield here and then we go off. Wait a minute. I 
let's go. So we just go straight to Hammerlock. All right. So that's when the Sword and Shield brothers are out that we go to each gym. Now I would have Liberty out front because Eternitas is a poison dragon type, but it's got a flamethrower. That was my Pokemon first. Liberty took a little bit of chip damage, just in case. I don't think Eternatus has any grass type, so Speedy should be okay. Because it resists fire, has a ground type move, so it'll be super effective against it. So yeah, we'll go with Speedy. Probably should have saved after talking to Olenek. Well, no, I, there's no point in saving, because if I lose, I lose. We start with, okay. Still, Speedy's a good one, because he has steel types. I think it's unfair. Especially since you're trying to set up on me, asshole. Alright, Speedy, I need you to get the biggest crit of your life. Damn it! Son of a... Forget about having to fight Chairman Rose. 
I just lost Speedy. Frickin' Swords Dance. Oh, come on. And Speedy would have been perfect against Eternatus. Perfect! I didn't think of it. I should have died in Max last turn. Max flare to set up the sun. And that way I can one shot this Copper Hawk. Because I have a feeling that it's going to live on one. Still can't believe I lost Speedy. Still can't believe it. Okay, well, it wasn't on one, but I knew I wasn't going to one shot. Now, if I had the sun set up, I probably could have one shot. Okay, so that's coming off the Zen headbutt. Pour one out for Speedy. Alright, um, well this opens up for Water Electric. I'll have to do some training.
Can you heal me up quick? No, I gotta talk to him. Okay. Let's go heal up. I still can't believe I lost Speedy. <sighs> Nothing we can do about it. I'll give it to Electra. <laughs> Can't lead with Charmin because of the fluffy ability. Sonya is my best bet, honestly. Just because that special defense. Did I, did I put her in the death box? Yeah, I did. Seven Pokemon. Lost seven. At least three of those we should not have lost. There's nothing I can do about it now. All right, Sonya. I have no idea. At least an Ultra Bar or something. All right, let's try and flinch him. God, even with the special defense, holy crap. Let's protect. Should have given Sonya leftovers. I forgot to sell the max revives.
That was a crit. Like, I live in one of those. Let's go with a brick break. Oh no, it's poison, so resist. And I get poisoned. Lovely. All right. Suppose we should go for crunch next. I almost feel like I should be doing more damage given that I'm four levels above. I understand this is technically a legendary, but... I don't like that. I, I did not like that at all. You, no, you don't do that anymore. Why'd I have to lose Speedy? Speedy would have been perfect! One more crunch. As long as you don't crit. Now that I said that, you're gonna crit, aren't ya? No, thank- that, Okay, that was a crit, but <laughs> Sonya lived it pretty handedly. Throw a Pokeball! Hurry, hurry! able to Dynamax. No, I thought I'd take it on by myself, Hop. Oh, it, okay, it is healed. Alright, good. All right, I'm just gonna protect. Y'all can deal with that bullshit. Oh. Hurry up, but let's get this bullshit over with. Yeah, that's a no-no. I do gotta say, this music right here is pretty good. They have a couple of good tracks in this game.
Alright, if I remember correctly, he mostly goes after Hobbs Pokemon. Pretty much leaves me free to do whatever I want. You know, in reality, I should be getting, um... A Moxie boost from beating the Eternatus the last battle. <laughs> That's right, increase my attack. Okay, asshole. Good thing light screen's up. So I'm back to neutral. My god, Hop, you're so goddamn stupid. I don't think you can flinch him, but let's see. Oh wait, he moves before me anyway, so there is no point. Go after the bulky Pokemon. Alright. I'm just going to protect just in case. Basically, what this is boiling down to is I just need to stay alive long enough for Zacian and, uh... What the hell is the other Pokemon's name? Yeah, it's a stall game. Yeah, exactly. Till Zama Z or whatever the hell the name is, takes it out. So it'll be the next turn. Zama Zenta. I highly doubt that's how it's supposed to be, but Zam Zamazenta, Zamaz Mazatan, Mazda? <laughs> I don't freaking know. Well, thanks for nullifying my attack downs. Why are you going after me? There's a dub wool over there that you can use Max Flare on. Use it. All right, whoops, back, fight, protect. Wait, did it say my protect failed? Oh, wait, that's right. Okay, I protected, then I healed. Okay. So technically the heal is still, or the protect was still used the previous turn. All right, I'm gonna crunch. Come on, Zacian, you could have just attacked.
There you go, attack the double! Yes, doggy, bark at the giant hand creature. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. Seriously? You're gonna let Hop get the final attack? <laughs> I love how he doesn't even want to try and catch him. He's just like, there you go, catch him. Catch him, my rival, get a powerful Pokemon. Really, I probably could have thrown a Pokeball and still captured this guy. Because I think you automatically capture him after all this anyways. And thank you. All right, so what the hell am I gonna name you? What do I name you? Do I not get a chance to name you? That's right, I can go to the Pokemon Center and uh, rename you. Hopefully it's a good natured one. Oh, does it have a nature? Okay. Cross poison, dragon pulse, flamethrower, dynamax cannon. Definitely a special attacker. What do I give you? You call hacks? Why do you call hacks? You know what? For the hell of it, I'm going to give you assault vest. You know what? I'm going to name it hacks. There you go. Can you go to the Pokemon... Gym, or, uh, gym. Pokemon Center. And I'm gonna rename it Hacks. Oh, come on. Should just fly. Yeah, let's just fly. Is there no rule against legendary? Is it even allowed area to catch the Pokemon and use it? Yeah, um, you weren't here when I first, uh, started as Nuzlocke, but I said that I do what is called static encounters, to where if you run into a legendary Pokemon, even if it's in an area that you've already caught it, then you are allowed to catch it.
All right, I'm gonna call it hacks. Wait, how much money do I have? No, I want the other one. That sells the carbos and all that. Glitch out. Didn't it say I just flew? What the? Says I'm right there. Okay, whatever. Now, I will say, though, that normally I wouldn't even use legendaries, but given that I just lost Speedy, I'm going to need whatever advantages I can get. Especially since uh, that's what I was going to use against Charizard. I mean, I have Sonya, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. God, I have a major fairy weakness going on right now. Yeah, just to give it that little bit extra of a boost. It didn't really give much. Wait, why am I coming in here? I don't need to heal again. Alright. We're gonna lead off with Sonya. Oh, she's already... Okay, she's already up front. What, is that not allowed for me to use uh, items that increase EVs? Because I don't remember ever reading that in the um, um, rules. And I just realized I forgot to sell the max revives again. Alright, Leon, let's do this. My Pokemon journey ends here with you. Oh, okay. See, I didn't have Eternatus, Eternatus or whatever with me when I faced Leon the first time. So that's a little bit of extra dialogue. He's like, oh, yeah, and you have Eternatus. Okay, well, you're really going to smack me around. Damn right, I'm going to smack you around. Age of Slash. Okay. Now, are you going to King Shield at first? I want to see what you're going to do. Oh, 
Okay, so you're attacking first. I could have went for crunch. Okay, I don't like that. Um, I really don't have anybody else that I can use. Well, I have Onyxia, so let's swap, and then now flamethrower. Thank you. Haxorus. Um... Let's go with Charmin. Just gets the fluffy ability. And the Rocky Helmet. We haven't seen Charmin this whole stream. First time in a while we haven't seen uh, Charmin at all. Well, it's a good thing I didn't go with my original plan since the Haxorus has Mold Breaker. Because originally I was going to go with uh, Claire. Superpower will do it. You want the defense drop? I should live this pretty easily. There we go. Haxer is down. Right here. Yep, we're gonna swap and we're gonna go to. Go to Sonya. Now, if only I still had a water type. Oh, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Um, fuck. Should have given Sonya leftovers. Let's protect. Yeah, but I don't know who I would switch out into. Because with Heat Crash and knock out Charmin, Liberty would get knocked out. Claire would get knocked out. I could swap to Hax. But I'm also trying to save Hax. Trying to save Hax for Charizard. I might have to risk Claire. I might have to risk the Rhyperior going for an Earthquake. Or even Liberty. Um, otherwise, the only other thing I could do is Crunch and then hope for a Flinch.
I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna see what happens. Did even more damage. Um, let's go, Liberty. I don't think Rapiri has good special defense anyway, so extra sentry might be able to do something. All right, good. I got a clean swap in. Damn, that's gonna be a three hit KO even from there. Fuck, I'm in a I'm in a really bad spot. I'm I'm gonna have to Dynamax and do it. Cause there's no way I'm gonna get a clean switch in on anyone now, so my best hope is to knock out this Rhyperior and go from there. Knock out the rip rip Rhyperior. Probably heal Liberty. I have to lose you, Speedy. You would have been just perfect. Rillaboom. He can have knockoff. But with the Dynamax, I should be able to live two of them, I would think. Wallace of them got to sack it anyways, so that was a waste. Why would you... Whatever, I'm not going to question it. True. So. I don't know. I'm gonna go for Rock Slide for whatever it's worth. Since he's gonna be stupid and do that, I'm gonna swap to Claire. Yeah, free move. drill pack. Wait, it's faster? I thought real boom is slower. Okay. Well, I haven't lost any Pokemon, but it's not like I'm in a great position either. Dragapult. Yeah, I didn't lose it. Um... All right, I'm gonna throw out Sonya. I'm gonna protect to see what he's gonna do, and then I'll heal. Because Crunch should be able to do some great damage. Yeah, and, if I, and then if I get the Moxie boost, I should be good. Flamethrower? Yeah, I should be good. All right. So now let's heal. Got 
that Oberon would have been perfect. Oh, of course you get the paralysis. All right, well, let's see if I can get a crunch off. And then depending on how much damage the Dragapult has, he may full restore, which will give me a full restore. All right. Now it's full restore. time All right, I'm going to keep Sonya out I think even with uh, Gigantamax, I should be able to live one fire attack. But I'm also going to stall it out. So I'm going to protect. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to protect, full restore. I'm going to gauge the damage. And if it's too much, I might stack someone off. Bring in Eternatus. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna try and do. I should be able to live this either way. Okay, so Protect does what? It does three quarter? Oh, shit. Okay, and if I remember correctly, since I have that flame crap going on, I can't switch out. So it looks like I'm going to full restore stall. Son of a... I'm getting caught up in a freaking critical because you shouldn't have. Mm. Fucking crit. At least that's the last turn of Dynamax. Get flinched. That's good. And down you go. <sighs> Freaking lost Sonia. If you didn't crit, full restore, full restore, and then. Rock slide, 
would have been over. Oh well. Yeah, GG. I honestly don't know if I want to continue and do the Sword Brothers. Because that's just an annoying run around just to get a legendary Pokemon. And they're going to give me the Master Ball. So I could just throw that and game over. Yeah, everyone did get so many freaking crits. I've lost half my team to crits. Actually, yeah, I think I'm just going to end the series here. I became champion. What's after that? I go around to the other gyms and just smack those guys around, and then I catch Zacian, and that's it. So, yeah, I'm going to end the series here. Plus, this seems like a really good spot to end the series anyways. I can't turn off the credits, can I? No. I guess we get to sit back and enjoy the credits. No, Pokemon is one of those games where you have to watch the credits the first time around, and then after you beat the game, then you can skip the credits. Yeah, it's all Nintendo games. It's like they're... It's like to give everyone a company notice, hey, all your games must have unskippable credits. Yeah, they're trying to tell everyone to try and find a way to die in games like SMG2 and NSMBW in the credits. You could die in the Mario Galaxy 2 credits? Really? So basically, they were pulling a dick move like, well, since you guys want to skip the credits and just mash buttons, we're going to make it possible for you to die. Sit through them like a good boy. Yeah, both those Wii games are credits where you can move around. Okay. What is uh, NSMBW, by the way?
I'm drawing a blank on that. Oh, new Super Mario Brothers Wii. Okay. See, I only ever got the Wii for one game, and that was Super Smash Brothers. And then the um, rest of the time, I used the Wii to play my GameCube games. So I didn't really uh, play any other games on the Wii. The only other game I played was um, Sonic Unleashed, where it had the motion controls. Where you had to lift the door and like. Argh! Argh! <laughs> Really, I should have picked up uh, Zelda Skyward Sword. But I didn't want to do the whole motion. <laughs> <laughs> the end. Now let's look at the champion team. Sony is a ghost though, but we'll look at the champion team. Oh, there it is. Come to me, champion. Come to me. No. Well, Sonya. Thanks for the memories. But you have to go officially into the death box. We have to make it official, unfortunately. So, Victor, Oberon, Rhonda, Zarian, Gunther, Paramore, Speedy, and Sonya. We all lost in this Nuzlocke. Pour one out for all eight of these champions here. And just for the heck of it, we'll move. Come on. We'll move Charlotte in. The series is over, but at least this way I could say I have a team in case I decide to pick it up again. <laughs> but I doubt it. But anyways, I'm going to end the stream here. <sighs> that was definitely a little sweaty there at the end with Leon. My God, I could have easily have lost that. If I didn't decide to put Eternatus in there, I definitely would have lost it. But... Yeah, um, either way, series is over. I, I'm i probably going to do Fall Guys next week just to have a little bit of a break from, like, a playthrough standpoint, just to have a little bit of fun and variation, I guess you could say. Um, and then I'm going to think about what I want to do next on stream. i got to still see if my uh, HDMI splitter will split the HDCP protections because I really want to stream either Dino Crisis or Parasite Eve, and I have them on my PlayStation 3. So I just got to see if it'll strip the protection so that way I can stream off my PlayStation 3. But uh, thanks for coming to the channel and checking out the playthrough Fizzy Pop. I appreciate it, and hopefully the next playthrough I do will uh, interest you as well. But, um, yeah, I'm going to end the stream here. Have a good day. Anybody who checked this stream out afterwards, thank you for checking it out. I have a YouTube channel as well. You can check out the video there as well. And I have other playthroughs. But um, until next stream, this is American Entertainment signing out. Hope you have a good one. Bye.